Getting right into tournament coverage, we'll start things off with Wyatt Young and Tucker Sargent fishing for Tarleton State. I kind of like that wind at our back yesterday. I mm know. -hmm. Made us cast a lot farther. Come on, big girls, be fired up. There's a fish. Fish? The predominant yeah, summertime yeah, pattern on Pickwick yeah. is ledge fishing. After the spawn, the bass group up in schools along the edge of the river channels. They're easy to find, but catching them consistently is another story. Yeah, let's keep her. Right on. Number one. There's a little creek channel that runs through this, and it's a little dip, and there's a there's a hard edge of uh, eelgrass right there on the edge of the dip, and there's a lot of fish in that channel, and they move up. But we just got to catch them at the right time. When they move up, they get in that grass and they feed. There's a mixture of high, some hydrilla stuff down there nah, too. I think it's milfoil. It looks mil like, some of it looks like hydrilla, some of it looks like milfoil to me, but that's what we're fishing right there is that eelgrass. Based out of Stephenville, Texas, Tarleton State University has two teams in the top five. This is Justin Seaton and Dakota Eber. They started the day in second after sacking up 2376 on day one. Yep. Yep. Good job, man. Look out. Dude, I had to, had to chase that sucker for a while. I didn't, I didn't know if he's swimming. Watch my ride. Watch my ride. I didn't know if he's swimming to me or what was going on there. Yeah, I had not my line. I got to get it off. All right. I ain't got time to fool with all that. We gotta get fish in the boat. Justin's doing a good job with that though, so. Looks like he's got a cold ring in him. Somebody's done <laughs> cold him out. <laughs> Sorry, I don't care. We'll take him. That's a, that's a good fish. Just like that, Seton and Ebear are on the board. Moving on, we'll check in with our day one leaders. This is Corey Neese and Nick Hatfield. That outside, edge of them. Huh? That outside edge of them. Fishing deep, Corey and Nick are relying on their electronics to locate the school and put them into position for a cast. Look, they're suspended, man. Mm -hmm. Biggins. God, man. We should get bit right there. Uh, yesterday morning, we pulled in here and uh, first cast in there, caught a five pounder and a three pounder in the same cast, same crankbait. Uh, we sit here after that, probably caught 10 or 15 fish, filled out our limit. So, it'd be nice to do that again today. They're still laying here, too. Yeah, they're stacked on here. There's three big ones sitting there, too. Okay. Monroe, oh no. Three pounder. They're gonna have to get bigger than that. Big old worm. Giant worm. Can't tell you the name of it. <laughs> they don't make them anymore. But kind of get scared to throw it. But believe it or not, it catches a lot of two pounders. You know, it's freaking giant. Sloan Pennington and Hunter McCarty are fishing for the hometown team of the University of North Alabama. Mixing it up, Hunter is dragging a worm while Sloan is fishing a swim bait. A good one. Came off the net, look at that. Woo, best net man in the south. It's my job, it's a start. Finger. Yesterday. It's cold, man. 
Hey, get it back in there, they're firing up. I just got another buck. 